Good afternoon, everyone. Thanks for watching Live at 5. I'm Mike Tang. And I'm Dana Winkleflack. Well, an EF3 tornado, of course, damaged many farms across Crawford County, Illinois, and Sullivan County, Indiana. Now, a nonprofit organization known as Farm Rescue in Illinois, helping a couple of farm families get their crops in the ground. Yeah, Jen Thompson joins us now live from Palestine, Illinois, where they have been planting crops throughout the day. Jen. I'm here in Palestine, Illinois, on the Noblet Far Family Homestead, where Farm Rescue has come to help the family after losing their barns and all of their equipment to the tornado. Farm Rescue is a non-for-profit organization dedicated to helping farm families going through a time of crisis. Whether it be an injury, illness, or a natural disaster like uh, like a tornado, uh, where, which is the whole reason we're here uh, around Palestine and Robinson, helping a few families that were greatly impacted. By. That tornado destroyed the farmstead of Doug Noblet in Palestine, Illinois. All of my machinery was hurt in some manner, uh, some of it much worse than others, but I don't, don't have anything operable at the moment. So they are bringing in a tractor and planter and we're going to get another tractor and to work some ground and they're literally going to go ahead and start my planting process. Farm Rescue's team of volunteers travel across the country supporting their mission and lending a helping hand. To serve as our boots on the ground um, and, and kind of are the lifeblood of what we do. They're out here, you know, actually fulfilling that mission and, and, and running that equipment and helping these families in a time of crisis. You've got people that's really hurting. And we're here to take care of that void while they get over their illness or their natural disaster. Kenneth Kyle has been volunteering with Farm Rescue for the last 13 years. He recalls the very first case he served on. I was planting corn and I called the guy about 30 minutes before I got there. Told him about what time I'd be there and he said, I'll be in the barn lot waiting for you. And he was, and I got out in the tractor and walking over to him, stuck up my hand and he bear hugged me and see tears rolling down his cheek and said, I don't know what I would have done if y'all hadn't got here. Kyle is thankful to be in a place in his life where he can now give back to others. Farm Rescue offers free planting, haying, harvest, and livestock feeding assistance to farm families. It's, it's short-term support, but uh, hopefully a long-term effect. It's such an enormous relief to have someone help like this so I can go ahead and deal with the disaster, the phone calls with the insurance companies. Every time I start a crop, either planting or harvesting, I try to do the farmer better than what I would have done myself. Farm Rescue relies on the support and generous donations of volunteers and individuals who can help. For more information on Farm Rescue, you can visit our website. Dana. All right. Thanks so much, Jen.